All right, I'm back. We and we are back to Outer Wilds. Resume expedition, which is basically the same as starting again. Well, I guess I have the launch codes. What? Sign drunk? Who's responsible for this? My keyboard was not lined up. What? I'm a kick typer. That's what I am. Some Saturday night drinking. Hey, he's allowed. He doesn't work tomorrow. Go away, Geyser. Nailed it. Does it come back out? Oh. There he goes. There's nothing to do with this, huh? Perfect. Seemed to me like a perfect landing. to do which I guess is the point 
Oh, uh, I was looking for the for the guitar guys, right? Oh. Uh, okay. Mark location on the HUD. Repair the ship. Ah, uh -huh. old. Fix that. Just like a new. Oh. Just like new. So I guess I found the key to this. Which is a log. Huh? Oof. Glad I remember this suit. So I signal locator. But what does it do? Did I not read this? Shit. I was upstairs testing the eye signal locator and it can hear and follow the signals from the sun, giant steep and brittle hollow. However, something strange is happening. When I ask the eye signal locator to follow the eye signal, the device's indicator rotates wildly and never points to just one direction. This is a curious result. It's possible the eye has stopped calling out its signal. I see. I most likely calibrated the locator incorrectly. Prove it, my apprentice, and I will make adjustments and try again. An update. Disappointingly, everything is correctly calibrated after all. It sentences me to 
posit this, my friends, but I believe we need to build a more sophisticated device if we want to find the exact location of the Eye of the Universe. Then we will build it. Don't lose hope, Kasava. Our search for the Eye is what brought our clan to this place. We won't give up so easily. The Eye of the Universe, huh? I guess... I guess that's something we want. Where should this new, more sophisticated locator be built? It may need to be larger than this eye signal locator is. Anona and those of us originally stranded on the Ember Twin built a quantum moon locator there. But the heat of the sun made its construction challenging. I wouldn't recommend building on that planet. The southern glacier on Brittle Hollow has the ample available space. I could construct a new building to house this proposed locator. Yes, let's build it there. I imagine our young friend Konoi would enjoy that immensely. He's always held a great interest in the eye, especially for a child born so long after the crash. We'll begin construction on Brittle Hollow's south pole immediately then. Okay, I guess that's where we need to head next. Okay, wow, wow, I've seen this ruin in other travelers' pictures, but seeing it for myself. It's really old, isn't it? But wow, this is the coolest day of my life. Okay, uh, time for some official notes. So this is some kind of Nomai locator. It can point out the different planets, which is incredibly cool, by the way. But from what little I can understand of the writing here, I think it was built to try to find something specific. I'm not sure. I also was able to translate something about the South Pole of Brittle Hollow, so I'll fly there to see if I can learn more. Yep, just gonna get back in the old ship and take off. Totally safe, mostly safe. Oh, stars above. Right. Okay. One only Artean village as well as the main source of explosions on the planet. No my statue in the observatory opened its eyes and looked at me. So strange glowing lights and my own memory flashed before my eyes. All says the statue has never opened his eyes before despite Orfell's best efforts. I came the very center of Timor Earth, used by Outer Wilds Ventures to train new astronauts. I successfully repaired another satellite for the sun. So I guess this means... Nomai device created pinpoint sources of distant signals. Nomai were disappointed by their failure to detect the signal from something called the Eye of the Universe. I was going to ask if uh, green meant it was still ongoing, but I guess that's still ongoing. The Nomai decided to build a larger, more sophisticated eye signal locator on Brittle Hollow's South Pole. Yes, dang it.
Why do you not dig it? Brittle Hollow. Can I tag it? No. Hollow's Lantern. Ah. The Outriders might already have a more relevant have more relevant cutscenes than Anthem. Uh, I saw a review... You know I like Dreamcast guy, right? Uh, his review, he said the story is absolute trash. But he enjoyed the game. He enjoyed the game overall. Riders, my, uh, I mean, it's a looter shooter. Sure. I fucked up. What? That was the end of the loop. And yeah, he he said, like, there's no balance if you're playing by yourself. How is Avengers by yourself, by the way? After campaign is meh. No, I mean... Can you play the campaign by yourself and uh, have a good time and not feel like it's 100 enemies against you? Or is there AI? Coming in a little too hot. Is it hard unless you want it to be? Challenge? One to four difficulties? Okay. So, how do I know where the South Pole is?
Ow. How do I feel about the game so far? I have no idea. I am... I'm intrigued. And I feel better now that I've found the log. But I... I have no idea in general. What's going on? Things are blowing up. Rest in force. No. thrown to the other side of the solar system. Yeah, this has happened before. fan of some some of the controls to be fair Take you some time to get back to the brittle hollow. Yeah. And I'll run out of fuel. Unless I let inertia take me, I'll run out of fuel. But even then, uh, I'll run out of time. <sighs> oh, I have no water. Fuck. Can I land on this boy? On this boy? Why am I timed? I have no clue. Things are blowing up. <sighs> I can't. No. No. Well, it's been fun. That was the opening of Dragon Ball.
I should probably investigate that, actually. There are too many things. I'm always saying I'm not a fan of open worlds. This is an open solar system. Let's go here. I was really confused about what this looked like. This isn't the gas giant, is it? It is. Still has a core. What? Official gravity repaired. Oh shit. Oh, this was water. Oh ship. Rest in peace. Hello? That looks amazing, though. Rest in force. Uh, the gravity here is a little more intense, isn't it? Gravity too. Yeah, yeah, it is. Not sinking? Alright, maybe I should get back to the ship. <sighs> I'm trying to sink and I can't. So, I can't get any closer to that. Okay, good to know. Ooh. 
You finished Naruto? Yeah. Platinum trophy. Thank you. Statue Workshop. I was watching someone play until dawn while they were finishing. I know we're getting in the anthology. It's a crime. It's only then green light another one. Yeah, or even buy the studio outright. But hey, I guess they bought Evo. Yay. Can't wait to play. Can't wait to play that that Evo exclusive. We're going to test the memory statues tonight. Flock says it could be dangerous, so we can't come. But what if we didn't use the door and snuck in the other way? Does anyone want to? Flock specifically told us not to do that. We don't want to see the test too, Lavi. But that's a huge risk to take. We probably shouldn't. Maybe Flock's. We'll let us see a later test. What's going on? I lost gravity? The fuck? About a headset for next time we do something like it takes two. Cool. For when we play Avengers, right? Right? <laughs> Can't wait. Like Siege. Welcome to Giant's Deep, friends. I'm excited for you to meet the statues. If I'm not in my dwelling, I'm likely in my workshop below, inside the island. Sony PS5 one metal. Needs something functional, not trying to get fancy. Those are super expensive though, no? Yeah, that's where I left my ship. Why is it all the way over here?
That's probably like a hundred, no? Mine got a lot of views. 60 to 80? Okay. I used mine a lot. But then, uh, well, this started breaking. Uh, 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 what is this? What is that island? Oh no, what happened? Are you saying, oh no, I will be able to handle David wearing those? I will not be able to handle David wearing those? What? <laughs> oh, I wish. Those are too expensive for me. <sighs> yeah, these are expensive. Sorry, sorry, pony. I hit my. Fair enough. No, they definitely work fine with PS5, so easy buy. Uh, I mean, last time the problem was I couldn't, I couldn't join uh, the party chat, could I? Oh. Uh. What? This thing left the planet? What the actual fuck just happened? This game is so fucking cool. It is. That it is. What are you? And go under. Outer Wilds Ventures. Uh, 
Let me in. My memory, please. Need to play this again for the first time. <sighs> to be honest, I'm not a big fan of the playing it. So like to tie me, tie me up, put me on the back of my horse and send me off across the country. <sighs> of course. What am I trying to do? I'm trying to get on top of this ship, see if I can enter it. Seems important. They mentioned the lost ship, I think. Didn't they? Ugh. Why? Now the Isn't that your ship? What? No. My ship has this an arrow saying ship pointing to it. Look. Quite simple really. Kill me now! I can't even enter this, can I? Oh. Let it end. Put me out of my misery now. My ship doesn't have all these barrels. Using oxygen as propellant. Yeah, let's use it all. Nailed it. So far? Still have no clue what I'm doing. Rest in force. <sighs> you do a lot less observing than I'd imagined. <laughs> You expected me to observe a lot. You need to loosen up, man. You're far too rigid. In what way? I, I'm trying to accomplish something that I can... That I can follow. How did I... Uh, 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 statue Island. Is this how adults talk sexy? Silent must be where the Nomai created statues like the one in our observatory. Found the Nomai statue lying on the beach. 
Looks just like the one in our observatory. I did? I think you are trying to find an objective, well, what you simply need to do is relax and explore the universe. Make your objectives, I think. You're going to die a lot. You're approaching this like traditional game. You seem annoyed each time you die. I always say you love exploring, so explore. Uh, I... It's... I, I like going off the beaten path. There's no path. From my mind, the ore from the site to craft a protective shell designed to physically seal off the central chamber inside Ash Twin. Once the shell was finished, the Nomai checked to ensure there were no longer any physical entrances or cracks. The Nomai discovered a species of four eyed semi aquatic life forms in the waterways near the mine. Um. Like, I, I like having a sense of direction, though. You can follow the objectives on this map as your path. Yeah. More or less. Brittle Hollow South Pole. Let's try this again. game is all about the unbeaten path. Everything is, an, is the unbeaten path in this game. There is no path. <laughs> I like a little more sense of uh, direction. I'm not saying I don't like it, it's just sometimes it feels like it's that those games where you make your own fun. Talk to the people again. I don't know if that's the problem. Did I not talk to everyone? Oh, shit. The trees are moving. The trees in this grove wander about freely. The entire plant roots and all. This is not normal. Even for the salient planet. I never see them move. Is that even possible? If anyone else witnesses this disturbing behavior, I implore you, record your observations here. Either these trees are aberrant or my brain must be. Alarmingly, it isn't only the trees. There is other matter in this area, such as that unusual shard of rock, moving in the same eerie way. Well, that rock is unusual for another reason, too. It possesses color and texture that I've never seen elsewhere on the planet. Hypothesis. This rock shard presence is significant. We should study it. Could it be what is causing other nearby objects to also move about this area? Plume is right. The trees do move. I confess I didn't notice until I read his notes. That's it. more. Beneath your feet lies the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. If you're preparing to make your first pilgrimage to the Quantum Moon, descend the steps to the entrance below. The knowledge held within will help you on your journey. Alright, nice.
Nani? Where is the entrance? Let's not fall in the black hole again, please. The crossroads. Mm -hmm. Ah, nice. What? Should have gotten the water. Hey, I found another guy. Oh, you launched. That's great. Great job, you. I guess that means I've been out here a while, huh? Well, uh, this is Brittle Hollow, but you probably knew that. A lot of history here, it's great. What are you doing here? I'm here to see the Hanging City. It's always been my dream to see it with my own four eyes, ever since I was a hatchling. An alien race lived in this solar system long before our species even existed. How could I not want to see what their civilization was like? Only, you've probably heard the others say it, right? I'm afraid of space, seriously. I'm more surprised than anybody that I'm out here. Do you want to know how I even got this far? I fell. Tripped over a gravity crystal. It's dumb luck I landed somewhere in my little scout. Somewhere my little scout says is halfway stable. Instead of being sucked into what's below... I've been gauging the stability of the ground around me using my little scout, and this seems to be the place with the best surface integrity, so I'm just going to stay here until I'm ready to move on. But that's enough about me and my problems. You didn't come all this way to listen to me blather, did you? Hey, that would be... yeah. I learned something. Uh, cool, what is it? I saw the Hanging City on Brittle Hall. You visited the Hanging City? Oh gosh, how was it? Was it amazing? Was it beautiful? Was it scary? The Hang City is where the Nomai settled permanently on Brittle Hollow. It was their most advanced settlement here. Why they chose to build their most advanced settlement so close to a you-know-what is beyond me. Maybe that kind of thing makes sense to a Nomai though. Maybe they needed the black hole for something? Where should I explore here? Oh wow, where should you explore here? Um, not the black hole, actually. That's very, uh, no. Which is unfortunate, because, uh, the most exciting stuff is all below the crust, including the Hanging City. That's just to the north. You can kind of see it from here. There's also this big dome on the South Pole called the Southern Observatory. Yes, that's where I was trying to go. You can't get inside from the surface. Trust me, I tried. When it fits like the rest of the Nomai structures here, there's probably a path to it beneath the crust somewhere. 
Good luck with exploring. Uh, if you learned anything about the gnome, I'd love to hear it. If it's not too much trouble. Alright. Thanks for your invaluable help. Oh my god. I think one of the guys is over this way. <sighs> this guy was in the posters for this game, wasn't he? I feel like I've seen him before. Must be tough to play with uh, gloves on. Tower of Quantum Knowledge. This is the path I took to get there. That gave me a little bit of a heart attack. Be welcomed in this place. Above you stands the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. You, if you are making your first pilgrimage to the quantum moon, ascend these stairs and obtain the last of the knowledge you need for your journey. Uh... I need my water. It wasn't that long ago that I took a break, but I think I'm taking another one. It's rule number one. I know, I know. Hey Norbrook, doing good, how are you? Just got the... the Nobita boy. Oh... well. Just got the Nobita boy uh, platinum trophy. I'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. I see I'm still alive, which is unfortunate. <laughs> Dave didn't pause and his oxygen is decreasing. That was the idea, man. I had a lot of fun. The Novita boy was amazing. I have to say, all the critics who did not enjoy that game are absolute idiots. Do you check the thing right here? I think I did yesterday. Yes, not yesterday. You know what I mean. When I when I played it. Nailed it. Dongers? What is dongers? What does that even mean? Yeah, I went inside. It said to go on a platform. I didn't find the platform. But yes. Nailed it. You explored about 5% of it? I did? Really? It's the controls, they frustrate me. I think above all, it's that. Not really exploring or observing anything, to be honest. Maybe the game just doesn't click for you. I don't know. So, you were saying I should talk to the people in the village again, Arrow. What, uh... Like... Did I not talk to them all? Yeah. Oh, no. Do you need a reminder? Do you miss something on your first expedition? I mean, I, I probably did, but... I wanted, like, I really wanted to clear, like, an entire quest line or something. I don't know, I, I am a little frustrated. I am. Like, I'm not saying there are... Oh, I, I, I haven't died here. <laughs> this game doesn't have quest lines in the traditional sense. You're trying to play a game. That this is not, instead of meeting the game as it is. I, I understand that. But it feels like those games that I've always criticized, like, uh, hey, make your own fun now. A 
that's the right idea though. What well, is? It's not a make your own fun game. You're getting that sense because you're not engaging. But what am I not? I I <laughs> I am le I am legit asking, like, what am I not doing? I understand, like, I'm not when I die in a place, I I don't go right back there. Like, I I don't push. What do you know so far? Uh, these guys did expeditions to the stars. There's one in each planet or whatever playing an instrument that I can hear. And this is, uh, solar system is um, experiencing explosions for some reason. I guess that is what I would know. I found I found a new quest line. Are the ones with the photo done? But I, I was following this. Yeah, I was trying to go here. I think. Yeah, I was trying to go here. The yeah, the the locator for the the eye, the eye of the universe or whatever. Have you viewed the entries? Not all of them. I viewed. Uh, the, I just took the village. I started in the village, right? So. I took the village, I read the village in the Zero-G cave, and I followed this path. And I was trying to go here. That's what I did. Which, I mean, is the, is like the closest I have to trying to follow, um... A quest line. I don't know, maybe I am too focused on getting progress, getting shit done, you know? I, I understand that. Also, how the fuck do I know which one is the South Pole? Yeah, I'm assuming that our Monica signal then connects to another camp. Where's the indicator about which one is uh, the South Pole or the North Pole? Is there an indicator for this? That looks like something. Uh, shit. Yeah, this looks like what I was looking for. Maybe. 
Nailed it. Found the entrance, guys. Hmm. Oh, no, the... No, no, no. The guy said that the entrance has to be underground somewhere. Because it's sealed off. I do remember that. It's not like I'm not paying attention. I, I guess I sometimes I take longer to care. What are you? Uh, I guess that's uh, the guy's ship. That guy I found. Well, he didn't find the entrance. I'm here, I did it. I put the ship down safely. Uh, in that the ship went down and I didn't sustain bodily harm. Few minor repairs and it's like the ship never even hit those rocks. One of my better attempts. Feldspar would, have, would barely have laughed at me, I bet. That's the good news. The bad news, I, um, haven't found a way inside this structure yet. The door is broken, and I know I'm not great at exploring. But I think I would have found a different entrance by now if there were one. Probably. I can't get inside from here, but I know there are paths below the surface. I'm going to head north to the ruins on the equator to find a way down. Seems definitely at your own pace, whatever that may be. Well... I only did two chapters of the story mission solo. Last chapter needed a little bit more strategy. Got two blue items. 101 though. Smint. Chat is English only. Please. This is your first and only warning. Best way I can put it is this is not about quest lines or following a guided plot or traditional storytelling. It's about the feeling you get when you look into space and realize there's infinite possibilities out there. So you have a yearning curiosity when you see something strange or interesting and feel the need to find out what it is. The game might just not be for you. Or maybe it just hasn't clicked yet. And I legally recommend you give it more time. I'm not I, I'm not saying I wanna stop. Talking about Ghost of Tsushima, sorry, David. <laughs> um, so, you haven't done the story? We can do it someday if you want. You don't need to do it by yourself. That's That doesn't sound fun at all. I did, but not on gold. Actually, me too. I think I only did them on bronze. Yeah, I'm not saying I want to stop. Just... I mean... To go back to a popular argument that you use against Mithro... I played Eat Lead. <laughs> Let me see if I can see something from above. You somehow enjoyed it? Yeah. Always have been a curious fellow. And I am curious about this. Um, uh, 
Yeah, this is too much, I think. Yeah, to be honest, even what I'm doing right now is being impatient. I'm exploring with the ship instead of on foot. I only see the one thing. He said if there was another entrance, he would have found it. How can I trust... can I trust that? Nailed it. Fucking nailed it. <laughs> but yeah, I, I don't know why I'm on a loop. Shall I try to find the harmonic instead? This mid fire fight. So on the outside of the planet with the ship isn't a bad idea. Okay. Holy shit, what the fuck? That looks friendly. Tech tight. Hey oh Hatchling, thought you were taking that tin can of yours into space today. What are you still living here? I mean, I saw something crash over the horizon, then like what I was seeing in the pictures my little scout was sending back, so I thought I'd come over here myself, take a look. So what crashed? 
I don't know what it is exactly. Looks like some kind of plant seed, but it's not anything I've seen on Timber Hearth before. But trust me, I was quite the explorer back in the day. Do you think it's extraterrestrial? It kind of looks like something that might have come off a dark bramble. Whatever it is, it put down roots in a hurry. I don't like the look of this thing, Hatchling. That's a fact. Think I'll set tomorrow and I'll lose on it. Best get rid of this mess sooner rather than later. No one can remove an unplanted plant faster than a tree keeper can. Plant cement? What? I'll have to get a, a look at what's inside the seed first, though. Don't want to set anybody to packing up a potentially dangerous plant without a better idea of what's lurking inside there. Tough gonna help me haul the old scout launcher over here. Obviously, the opening is too small for someone to fit inside, and anyway, I'm not gonna blindly stick my hands into anything that looks as unpleasant as that seed does. That's a good way to lose an arm or two. Is it? <laughs> well, he mentioned the scout launcher in yellow. Did he eat the person? Did it eat the person with the harmonica? Hmm. Oof. There's more to explore here. Ah! Okay. So, it doesn't say there's more to explore in the town, then. The seed from Dark Rainbow crashed here and has already taken root. Tektite wants to use a scout launcher to get a look at what's inside. My signal scope picks up harmonica music when I aim at it... When I aim it at the seed. Hmm... Yes. So I need to find tough or I'm I mean he didn't ask for anything but I'm assuming I should ask for Tuff and tell him to come here. This is the scout launcher being in yellow. Did I try the scout launcher? I thought I... No, I did not. Do I have a scout launcher? Is that what it's called? It is... Oh, okay. I thought, I thought another character had to use a scout launcher. Oh, it's one of those disappearing rocks. Is it? No. No. What? Yep. 
Yeah, I, I saw it when I unbuckled. Okay, the tree and the stone change places. So let's get back to the thing. No! Going a little too far. Thank you. Calculated. I mean. I can't tell you it was a mistake. Actually, I can't. What is the uh what is here? Just nothing. I actually feel like if he's okay with this manifold might be okay. Uh to be honest, I'm more okay today than I was last time. Last time was uh, getting a little rougher, so... It depends, I, I guess... This is the, f the first time is always the worst, right? Ah! Church research notes property of church. I've detected a strange signal coming from somewhere within the grove in this crater. Step by step, day by day. It's very similar to the signal emitted by the quantum moon, so it stands to reason the two signals are probably related. We don't know much about the quantum moon, seeing as no one has ever been able to land on it, but hopefully studying the signal in the grove will reveal more about it. Shippurogu updated. You, you all know what this is, don't you? This is what's going to signal the Reapers to come and consume this uh, solar system. Don't know, never played? <laughs> well... I keep discovering new... How many trees are there? Meanwhile, I'm still trying to get here. Oh, I have a HUD marker to get there. Okay, great. I noticed that. Definitely. Definitely noticed. That. 
Metal Crazy is regular crazy? He is. scared me. Electrical systems damaged? Why? Did I hit something? I guess. What a landing. I know. No! Rest in force. I thought people only died in fire if it was an accident. If if it wasn't an accident is what I mean. Ah, oh, leave me alone. I can't even speak. Did it remove the, the marker from my head? Probably. Definitely towards the smoke. I was attacked by a ghost? I was. It was the ghost of Tsushima. Uh, eat shit? I can't control it, right? Camera is weird. Tell me about it. Oh, 
what is this? What what is the the L1 rear view snapshot? What's the same thing? No, it's just... No, it is the same thing. What the fuck? What are we looking at? Your guess is as good as mine. I, I send this through, it's the same image on every entrance. Inside the seed. Watch my little scout into the seed. Some of the seed is much bigger on the inside. When I launch my scout into the seed that crashed on Timber Hearth, it ends up somewhere in Dark Bramble. It does? In Dark Bramble? I thought Dark Bramble didn't exist anymore. Isn't that the one that blew up? Uh, I guess not. Well, it is. That's not it, is it? I wish this would point me at the thing I tag.
That's what I want. They want pizza and I'm ready to clog several laboratories. <sighs> I'm a fool, and I'm pretty sleepy too. I couldn't eat. I had dinner with my dad and my grandmother today, which prevented me from having a nap. Pineapple pizza, yeah, that's Thro's favorite. Tuna pizza when I'm out? Yeah. Do it. Davy doing bramble things. I'm trying at least. Who knows what I'm doing really? Am I doing anything? Yes, you can clip that. I found nothing! David dies again. Such 
an unoriginal name, man. Poster check indeed. Ah, fuck. Thank you for the clip. Boom. Nailed it. Assuming direct control. Hmm. I close this. <laughs> okay. Calculated. I don't want to explore the ones that are not green. Like, I, w I want to be able to do something, to finish, like, a quest line or whatever. Whether or not I shouldn't... I just, I just want to. Shit, 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 shit. Ah. I survived that.
Perfect. It's in perfect shape. Does anyone observe the phantom moon that sometimes greets us in the night sky? Your thoughts interest me. I have not. I'm interested in your playful moon. Is it much like its violent friend, Hollow's Lantern? Imagine if there were two volcanic moons. The moon isn't volcanic. In my hand and the ice, sometimes it leaves its friend all those lantern for nights at a time. I imagine there would be none of us left. There can exist too much lava. Surely before we test the null hypothesis. The nights the moon circles this planet a pure random. It seems to travel as it likes. I compliment your eyes. How do you imagine it disappears? Hypothesis. Could it be a shift in the light spectrum? I suppose this moon is too shy to show us its face. Isn't this all the same day anyway? They're always there, and it's never there. <sighs> I feel like this is familiar. To our friends on Brittle Hollow, I just warped here from the White Hole Station on the other side of Brittle Hollow's Black Hole. Our design work, we've successfully recreated warp travel. This is wonderful news, I can't wait to see the warp tower, although it's been a long time since I've jumped through a black hole. I don't know how close it is to Anona's original design, but as long as we've as what we've built works, then I'm delighted. I know we could do it. Cassava, I hope you're reading this. Wait, this can't be correct. Clary, have you seen these readings? If they were accurate, they would violate causality. There must be an equipment error somewhere. I'm returning to the Whitehall station. If you and Root meet me there, we can run a full diagnostic and hopefully locate the problem. Don't tell Cassava. I don't remember what, how to do this. Did I? 
Did I end up figuring it out? Maybe not. Maybe I don't remember because I don't know. That makes sense, right? The hanging city below 50 meters. <clears throat> I read this. Oh, yeah. Where's my ship? Ow. I connected orange with uh, purple. That seems to be important. Northern Glacier. Yeah, I'm quite tired, guys. I, I think uh, when I die, that's going to be it for today. This looks like something. Not not what I'm probably not what I'm looking for, but definitely something. Might as well, right? Yeah, is it this dark? Looks like uh Narita Boy. Distress Beacon from Narita Boy himself. Collision imminent, preparing for impact. Scanning external environment, scan complete, minor structural instabilities detected, pockets of breathable air detected, adequate solar energy detected. Spittable. Launching escape pod 3, launching escape pod 2, la launching escape pod 1. Escape pod 1, vessel has been mortally injured, emergency sequence activated, awaiting departure from vessel. Emergency escape hatch. Uh, oh no, I broke it. I broke it! Maybe I need that on the other side. Caution, the black hole see sleeps below. You must not sleep. <sighs> oh. 
Let's try it, I guess. There they are, aren't they? Anyway, um, starting fresh tomorrow, hopefully I'm better rested. Well, at this hour, I'll always be dead. If, uh, if I'm not, like, uh, doing things. But uh, I actually thought there would be something on the other side of the black hole, now that I've sent stuff through. Or maybe I didn't see them. Anyway, uh... Reset loop? Yeah. I'll be back tomorrow with uh, more Outer Wilds. Um... Check Discord for maybe afternoon something, or not, who knows? Probably not, probably yes, because I don't know. It depends on uh, what time I wake up. So, yeah, have a good night, thank you for hanging out, and, uh... David? Yes? Get some rest? <laughs> I'll try, I'll try. Have a good night, guys. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for watching. <laughs>